Hello everyone, my name is Blake, and welcome back to our video. I'm here today, once again, in Farming Simulator. And I am actually doing a different kind of video today. So we are here today, as you guys know, on the new channel known as What Blake Farming. And we are actually starting a new farming series today. So what I need to first go, over, go and do is um, head over here and pick up my stuff. Uh, which I have already bought except for the combine the combine I am buying used and that is already at um, That's at a lot where I need to go pick it up later. I think I can already see some of my stuff back there um, As you guys can see in the top right um, From selling my old farm and equipment um, I was actually able to get a lot and um, Yeah, so we were able to move. I also have the new truck here. This is the 2020 Chevy Silverado So yeah, I know it's super nice, but then um, yeah guys we were actually on wind chaser I believe the map is and uh, Yeah, this is a really nice map and if I open up the map really quick if I open them the map really If I open up the map really quick as you can tell it is huge and we actually own two plots of land We own this down here so these three fields and then this land then we also own this here with these two fields so yeah guys let's go ahead and run inside the gate here they said they'd leave the gate open and there is all of my stuff but i'm a little bit confused because i got a semi two so where it's like oh there it is huh that's weird shops don't normally hook up like the semi and the trailer for you but i guess this one did well that was really nice but, um, yeah, guys, we have a Kenworth here. I believe it's the T-800. Okay, guys, it was a little bit wrong. It's uh, Kenworth Warrior uh, with the sleeper. And then we just have the regular Pils Wilson pace setter. And over here, we have uh, two tractors, actually. These are... 4850s by John Deere. I'm actually going to hop into this one, and then I'm going to start hooking stuff up. Okay, and then I also have uh, another 4850, and then I have four J&M 680 grain carts. So what I'm going to do, actually, is I'm going to have my truck um, hook up to two of the um, wagons, and then I'm going to have um, the other tractor go to the other so there you go, go ahead and hook up the planter here. And then I'm going to get the planter out of the gate here just so it's ready to go. Just put it off to the side so it's out of the way. So we have these two nice and ready to go. So there you go, got one done. So we got to run inside of the other one real quick and hook up two of these grain carts. Just so we can have it, you know, to be honest, we could just do a huge grain cart train and do four of them But I think that'd look a little bit crazy and Yeah, that might not work the greatest so um, as you guys can tell again I'm not getting an auger wagon just because I feel that these are a lot easier for getting stuff around and um, Yeah, I can um, also uh, get an auger and I'm just fine with these. I actually just need to move this really quick guys because it's not going to turn right All right, there we go got the wagons line up there um, Okay, there you go and attach the second one and I can pull this out and out of the way So um, we also are going to be buying a Mayrath grain auger But um, that just hasn't come in yet according to the shop So it should be here by the next episode and we should be able to use these wagons normally so let's go ahead and park that there and um yeah guys so i'm gonna go ahead and actually i'm gonna start by taking the um wagon tractor home and then i am going to come back bring the other tractor home come back again and i'm gonna grab my truck and get the two uh other wagons and then I will bring the semi home. So yeah, guys, um, let's start the drive home. It's not very long, and I'm actually going to keep the speeded up version in here just because I just realized I said speeded, but that's okay. Um, but basically, I'm going to keep the sped up version in here just because I think the scenery is ac it actually, it feels really realistic. That's how I'd say that. It feels really realistic. So yeah, guys, um, let's just go ahead and get to the time lapse. Alright guys, here we are, 
made it back to the house. So, um, yeah, we have a nice little turn off here into the driveway, and then we actually have some sheds up here to our left as well, and then the house and the fuel station, but I'm actually going to go off this way, and then over there, as you can see, we have our, um, grain, grain bins, and over the, there's another shed right there, actually, and then over there is the hog barn. So what I am actually going to just do is I'm going to leave these grain wagon sitting out just because it's not very important it's not like essential that they get put away and they're gonna be a hassle to put away so i can just do that later but i'm gonna keep them attached uh but yeah let's go ahead and switch and detach that and then i'm gonna put the tractor in this shed here all right go ahead and back her up nice and easy over to the wall here and there you go. All right, we got the first 4850 here. So I'm going to go ahead and head back to the shop, guys. And I'll see you guys in just a second. All right, guys, here we are back at the shop with the second 4850 and the planter. So we're going to go ahead and get heading home with this one. And, uh, yeah, see you guys in just a second. But, yeah, guys, um, once again, um, if you guys did make the move, over from my other channel to this channel, thank you very much. Your support really helps out, and it really makes me realize just how how great of fans I have, really. So, yeah, thank you guys a ton for coming over here. I just, it's so cool that you guys were willing to do that. And, um, yeah, I'm going to be trying to put out content every other day on this channel, just like on my main channel, but, um... Hopefully on different days as well. See so you guys. Um, we'll have content every day. But it's going to be kind of hard considering the fact that I have school right now. It's the school year, as you guys know. And my school year ends kind of late compared to some others. So it's going to be a little bit difficult for me to be able to make videos. Especially if they're going to be going out on two channels. Which combined is daily. So it's going to be a little bit crazy. But I'm going to actually go past the first driveway. Because I actually have another driveway down here. Which I believe leads to another shed. Which is I believe. um, Yeah that shed right there. That's where all of the uh, mixing materials go. And things like that. Like you know straw and chaff. And things like that. But let's go ahead and pull off to the side here. Um, and I'm gonna just bring the planter up over here. And then that's actually, I think that's a cow barn right there, if I am not wrong. And the planter, I want to actually try and kind of at least put under something. Um, I don't think I can do it over here because these gates are weird and they don't actually open. So, I'm gonna just turn around and I'm gonna put it in one of these sheds over here. Okay, guys, so basically, I just realized that over here, there is a free extra stall. So that, yep, right here, as you can see. So that is where I'm going to put um, this planter, just to be sure that it stays shielded from all the elements. And nothing on here gets uh, broken or rusty or anything too quickly. Just to save ourselves some money so we don't go broke just making repairs. There we go, go ahead and back up right there. Alright, there you go. So now I just need to go ahead and go put the other tr this tractor away. And then I can run back and I can get the final two wagons with my truck. And then I will be able to drive back and get the semi. So, um, yeah guys, if you guys do enjoy this series, please make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Because I will be doing this uh, series often. As I said before, I would love to do be really active on this channel and make some really great content for you guys so um yeah just let me know what you guys think all right guys here we are back at the shop with the truck so now we just gotta run in here and grab the two jnms really quick okay so now probably just gonna have to turn around hook up to one then just do some really annoying backing up to the other because backing up to these green carts is almost impossible. With another one attached, excuse me. I'm just going to try and straighten it out so I can back it up. This is just 
difficult. Okay, yeah, I can't straighten it out, guys. I'm gonna have to do it by hand. Okay, there you go. Got it. So let's go ahead and take these last two 680s home. So then we will have everything home besides the truck, but I can grab that later. And, um, yeah, so I'm gonna be, I'm gonna head back home, and I'm gonna get all this stuff put away. But, yeah, if you guys did enjoy this video, please make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. And, yeah, I will see all of you guys in the next video. Peace out, everyone.